Good morning. Welcome to Mahale. If you're not sure where Mahale is, it's in Tanzania on Lake Tanganyika. I came here yesterday. I was in a bush plane that made like three stops. Then I got on a boat and I was on that for about two hours. And then I got here. But I woke up in this gorgeous Gilligan's Island type paradise. And today I'm out to see the chimps. It's one of the only places in the world where they have been habituated to be around people. So you can get really close to these wild chimps. So I'm super excited. I'm gonna go out today and see if I can get close to them. There's a group of scouts that go out in the morning to go find the chimps. And then they call here. As soon as we get the call, we go. Where the chimps are, we trek them. You never know what kind of encounter you're going to experience. I'm with Moiga, trekking chimps, day one. Are we gonna see some chimpies? Yes! How many chimpies are we gonna like see? It's like a whole group. It's not often to see a whole group by one time. Is it just over the mouth or the nose too? Uh, put, put down at the moment. Okay. And then when we get closer there, okay. we'll put up. Trekking gear on. Yes. So what we got here, we got Darwin and Teddy. This guy are good friends. We found some chimps. Chimps are right over my shoulder. This is incredible. I can't believe how close we are. That chimpanzee is, uh, we saw Michio. He was pausing. They took the saliva and then they put on the wound. So this is fried eggs. Yeah, they open it like this and then they chew it. They the taste is a little bit like a cashew nut. It's a little bit bitter. You can see around me, it's very green and it's dense. We're so close. That is a water berry. Oh my god, look at that guy. Okay. He's gonna bang there. One of the male chimps is trying to get one of the female chimps. And uh, you want to mate with that female up there. I went today and it was exhilarating, completely exciting. I could feel the chimp energy. These are powerful animals. A few times it passed me by and I was like, oh my God, what do I do? I don't want it to attack me, but it won't, it won't attack you. But still you feel that, that little thing in your heart that goes, oh no. But it ended up being very peaceful. They go on living their lives and they all have their own personalities. Some of them were hanging out posing, some of them were playing in the trees, some of them were exerting their dominance, some of them were trying to mate. Now if I had it my way, I would hang out with the chimpanzees all day. But the government has a mandate to preserve the chimpanzees, so you can only hang out with them for one hour out of the day. This is my hut, made out of parts of boats. Kind of beautiful, right? Pretty cool little walkway to the bathroom. Here's the bathroom. Here's the shower. This is the toilet. They call it the bush TV. And every now and then, you'll see a monkey. This is my bed. It has a couch. Look at that couch. I'm in my hut, and right outside my door are some little monkeys. Oh my god, isn't that baby cute? Oh, look at him go. He's so cute. <laughs> Chimp trekking day two. Let's see what they're gonna do today. Hopefully one jumps in my arms. <laughs> Today's hike, we have to go about an hour and 40 minutes. Sometimes the chimps are close, and sometimes they're far and you have to go get them. Getting close, starting to hear the chimps talk. Mask on, it's go time. This is so exciting. Look the alpha man up there. Chimps are wild. They're not behind bars. They're not trained. They are only habituated, so they're still completely wild. And they have their own politics and systems and culture. It's incredible to watch them interact with each other. I'm so excited. And I, the chimps just keep coming right by us. You feel their power. And you never know what they're gonna do because they're wild animals with just so much blood. Definitely an adventure trekking chimps. Really cool. I just had a bunch of chimps come by in like a little chimp parade. Um, I saw the little baby swinging in the tree. I saw the mama with the baby. We saw one of the chimps pick up a stick and throw it at us. <laughs> that was pretty funny. We're getting some good stuff.
Greystoke camp ended up being phenomenal. The chimps were literally this close to me. This close. I had heard about this place, but it exceeded my expectations. It's basically the ultimate getaway. You are removed from society, but in the best way possible. Bye! See you next year. <laughs>